What do you think this place was for? What the hell? Are they asleep? No. They appear to be well preserved. However, they are all... dead. Dead? So this is... a mass grave? Looks that way. However, none of them appear to be Helganquil. Bear in mind that Renans were originally Danans, who were remade and sent to live on Lenigus. Knowing that, they would have needed a place to perform the procedure somewhere. And that place is here, I assume. So what you're saying is that all of these are Danon, or rather, Renan bodies? Most likely, yes. It must have been abandoned for one reason or another. There are so many of them. They were all taken away, but never given the chance to wake. Thing. Something we have to fight if we want to get across, it seems. Be careful! It's huge! What is with all the huge... ...lovery beasts lately? It's no ordinary zoo. That much is damn sure. Watch yourselves. All bets are off when it comes to this thing. Here I come! Sonic Spear! Luna Corrupt! Demon Lash! Chris in a vine! A thrilling Luna. performance! Now you see what I can do! Raging Luna Storm! Demon Lash! 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 Demon Probably something that was made here and somehow managed to survive, even after all this time. Not that there's any way of knowing now. 
What's wrong? Oh, I just suddenly found myself contemplating what might have happened to the sovereigns that were meant to emerge from the crown contests. What do you mean? You see, the winners of the past crown contests were all strong astral arts practitioners. Furthermore, that enemy we just fought appeared to be composed of several human bodies. It was certainly nothing one would find in nature. You're saying those were the remains of the winners? That they forgot who they once were? I'm merely saying it's a possibility. That's... absolutely gruesome. How long had the Helganquil been at this? It was Rena's great spirit that made them do all of this. Anything to get its astral energy. <sighs> We're not gonna jump down, right? I certainly hope not. After hearing Donalim's suggestion, I'm honestly not sure what to say. I assure you all, I was merely stating the possibility. <laughs> so, looks like the Helganquil have been engineering Zoogles too. Why doesn't that surprise me at this point? The creatures we've been encountering here have been a little different to what we're used to fighting, but I'm pretty sure they're Zoogles too. Do you think they were engineered using creatures native to the area? Indeed. However, based on the current circumstances, I would guess these Zoogles are all that's left of the planet's fauna now. You mean... there might have been native owl species here once upon a time too? in that other room? Did the teleporter fail or something? Something feels off about it. Look! Everything's upside down! The furnishings are, at least. No, you're right. The whole room's flipped on its head. So what was once down is now up, and vice versa. I suppose the teleporter reversed our orientation, then. This is the flip side of that pathway we were walking on just a little while ago. This is crazy. Who knew such amazing technology existed? Everything's topsy-turvy and that's all you can think about? Bear in mind, the core of Rena now sits above us. I pray that we won't encounter many stairs along the way. Let's dispose of the truck. Healing circle! Lightning Raging Cascade! There. Thanks for the healing. Watch yourself, okay? Yeah, go. you too. Dynamite in the air! Resonate the enemy. Heavy! 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 This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Remember to tell me if you need healing. I expect you'll be in high demand if that's the case. What are those? They look like Xion's thorns, and with flowers, too. Not real ones, though. They're just like that flower growing out of Rena. We must be getting close to the Great Spirit now. Hey, Rinwell, what was that thing you said about how a little bit of Dana's Great Spirit is inside all of us? Right. That's why Dana's Great Spirit is so much more... diluted. Weak, even. Whether it was a choice so it didn't overpower others, or just the way it is, is anyone's guess. 
If that's true, then wouldn't it mean Dana's will could never form under natural conditions? Yeah, sounds like that's probably the case. So if Dana exists within all of us, then what if something occurred that brought everyone's hearts and minds together as one? That unity could potentially act as Dana's will. You mean if everybody was like, thinking the exact same thing at the exact same time? Come on, there's no way we could pull that off. I know it's a long shot, but it might work. Let's assume that's even possible for a second. Would it even be enough to fight back against Rena's great spirit? If nothing else, it might be an option if we can't use the Rena Salma. Things are different here than on the surface. That shows how deeply we've ventured into Rena. And how close we've come to the real enemy. So here's a question. We came all this way to Rena on the assumption the Rena Salma's here, right? Don't. Just don't say it, Law. Yeah, but I'm just saying... I said don't. <sighs> I can understand why you might be concerned, Law. But you need to remember that there are people it affects more directly than you. <laughs> oh, sorry. We've managed to make it this far believing. Losing faith now won't do us any good. We're better off focusing our anxiety elsewhere. Such as? The Great Spirit. If Hevrecht 35's to be believed, our enemy won't just be handing over the Renus Alma to us. At least, not without a fight. Not only that, but that same enemy just gulped down more than an entire world's worth of astral energy. Hmm, point taken. It may be strange to say, but when I'm fighting, or at least know what needs to be done, it helps me a lot. I don't doubt myself as much. So thanks, both of you. <sighs> the floor's on the ceiling and the ceiling's on the floor. This whole thing's making my head spin. Why would they even do something like this? The Helganquil can bend life forms to suit their will. Nothing they could do at this point would surprise me. The ceiling is on the floor! That doesn't weird you out? What good is a team made up of members who all share the same opinions on everything? And besides, when you get to be at my ripe old age, one begins to consider it quite uncouth to show one's true emotions at times. Oh, come on, Grandpa. You can't be that old. The sands of time wait for none of us, lad. Yeah, we'll see. Though at this rate, I guess I'll have to live long enough to get as old as you first, huh? You will. And when the time comes, I look forward to hearing you change your tune on the matter. Oh, 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 oh,
within reach. But there's dig deep, and we can do this. No, the Crestus Spur has the airborne scouts. Sounds like it's this ends now. Consider yourself finished. There you go. Come on, you made quick work of them. Now, that's my team. Astral energy. Say no more. More super? Keep calm and take them down. Negative kill. Finish. More with that. Burning I'm ready. Look sharp. Lightning tiger blade. Not a chance. I was improving. <laughs> Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood. Zoogles here are putting up a real fight. That just goes to show how important this place is. Or perhaps they simply thrived freely here under such harsh conditions. I don't give a damn why they're here. We'll burn it all to the ground. 